Shields up, my fellow Ironbreakers. <clears throat> How's everybody doing today? Hopefully you guys are having a nice little Monday. And hopefully I'll be able to improve upon that. We shall see if that is the case or not. Today I'm going to be checking out Steam World Dig 2. For the very first time. And um, I know I'm late. I know I'm very late when it comes to checking out Steam World Dig 2. That is not by lack of trying. As I'm sure Image and Form can confirm. Image and Form are the developers behind SteamWorld Big 2. I've actually requested a code to them quite a while back. And I never got a response. Because they're, you know, they're in the... Whoa. Kagarin. <laughs> Kagarin with the seven months of grossly incandescence. Thank you very much for your support. Tip of the hat to you, sir. Really appreciate it. But as I was saying, um, I've actually requested the code quite a while back, but these guys are indie devs. They're super busy doing their stuff, so I understand. And then I requested again, and they still didn't get back to me. And then the day I was like, you know what? I really want to check out the game, you guys. And they finally sent me a code. <laughs> anyway, uh, this is on the Switch. So this is Switch code. Uh, and I'm going to be checking the game out on the Switch. And this is the very first time I'm playing, so let me see real quick here. Disable flashing. What? All of the flashing. Kineptic seizures and shit. Yeah. Uh, I'm pretty sure they will tell me the controls once we start the game, so I don't have to worry too much about that. What are these extras? Contact. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> then we got the credits, of course. Oops. Didn't mean to hit that. Let's get it started. What level of challenge do you prefer? Easy or normal? Normal, of course. You kidding me? Easy? What am I? Casual? <sighs> Missing Rusty. Quiet type height, one tile, contact Dorothy McCrank. Rusty, I believe, was probably the... Isn't this the robot that was in the first SteamWorld dig? Because I didn't play that much of the first one. Whoa. Paladin Leroy. Oh, dude. You missed out on the combo, Leroy. Damn. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> oh, shit. That sucks. <laughs> Because Leroy has been subscribed for I don't know how many months. Then I took a, a bit of a break from Twitch. And now he's just resubbing. Anyway, tip of the hat to you, Leroy. And I'm sorry that you lost your combo. The Wombo combo. Yeah, I know. But as I was saying, I believe Rusty is the guy from the first SteamWorld dig. I didn't play too much of that one. I did play SteamWorld Heist quite a bit. That was fun. It was a different type of game. Played that, on, that one on 3DS. I actually really liked it. Which is why I'm so curious about... Uh, but this one's... Ooh. Where have you gone, Rusty? I like the animation so far. It's got, like, this fluidity to it, which is pretty cool. Looks like we can't actually dig there. Not here. No? El Machino. One mile. Miners wanted. There's Tumbleton over there. Continue east to El Machino and dig up your destiny. It is your destiny to dig up in El Machino. Oh snap. Whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't do that. Not my fault. Oh, you can totally just like climb up walls. Okay. That means that climbing up walls is most likely going to be easy for the most part. But I'm sure they're going to come up with some mechanic that circumvents that at some point. No, the, everything's breaking. Am I going to fall before I get to one mach El machino? No, stop it. No, no. Ouch. Scrap, gosh darn it. My light broke. What is this place? I'll have to explore it to find another way out. Ah. 
So you can't mine while you're in the air. You need to be on solid ground to mine. Okay. It's a limitation to take into consideration. Different tiles will require more. Now, the first one was procedurally generated, but I've been hearing that this one isn't. I wonder why they went from procedural generation to not... Probably they're going to have specific mechanics, which will justify that choice, I'm assuming. I like the art style, and I like the animation on this. Okay, so if I'm over here... Oh, here we go. Okay, so there's a timer to it. No! Oh, I'll have to be running. Either way, before we go there, let's actually check out the rest of the level. Whoa! No thank you. No thank you very much. Can I break this? No? But I can break this. What? The earth regenerates here? Let's deal with that. You can get stuck. You too can get stuck in a pile of sand. You can't dig through there. Not through here. I'm just going to start trying to dig through everything. That's pretty much my motto. I mean, the game's called Steam World Dig, so I guess I should be able to dig. I want to dig. I don't want to fall in the fire, though. Okay, this does look like Dig Dug. I don't know how many of you guys will remember that stuff, though. Dig Dug's pretty old. Although the one that I played was in an Amstrad computer. Whoop! Whoa, that goes straight on through. Okay. Douche. Oh, I've actually gotten this thing. Aw, oh, damn. Oh, but I can still break through here. That's okay. Do I want to go back up? Oh, it doesn't seem like there's a link. But I definitely want to keep going down. Dude, can you imagine how many secret things are probably hidden throughout this game? It's gotta be, like, sick. Aha! Upgrade cog! You can't get nothing past me! I'm the Iron Breaker, son! Nothing gets past me! <laughs> Actually, probably most things do get past me. <laughs> Pal and Leroy, this is the perfect game for re Really? No! The spikes! And the arrow. Wow, this is just chuck full of traps. Ooh, what's this? Did I just get eaten? Oh no, looks like we got powered up. Yeah! Super Saiyan mode! Got sprint hydraulics. Oh, we can run now. Well, that's what I'm talking about. Obviously, we can't go there. Uh, there's water here. I don't know if you can dig through this. Nope. For a game called Steam World Dig, there's actually quite a few things I can't dig through, okay? I just thought I'd bring that up. Kind of feels like it's an important piece of thing that should be thought of. Just saying. I want to be able to dig through more things. Okay. Anyway. Wee. Well, that's what I'm talking about. So why would I want those arrows to fire there? And also... Can I break any of these? No? Okay. Doesn't look like there's like a breathing meter, meter or anything, so... Oh. 
Oh, I get it. Oh, snap. I definitely don't want to touch that one. Because that's probably going to shoot arrows throughout all of these motherfuckers. No, do not touch that dial. Do not touch that dial! So these things will go down if I'm able to break these boxes. I'm assuming eventually we'll... Wait. Oh, they're taking me all the way back. So that I can go to that door that I wasn't able to open previously. Wow. Here I was thinking, oh, I'm finding out all this secret stuff. And the game's just like, <laughs> You funny. You so funny. Can I keep falling through here? Is that okay? Is that cool? Is that chill if I just pick out the bottom? It looks like it is pretty chill. Dude, she can run fast as hell and jump pretty fast too. Okay, we're gonna have to run a little bit faster make sure we don't get ourselves killed through here. Oh, glorious guiding light, please shine on me. You may bask in my destructive glow. What? Blessing, wonderful rupture awaits. Rapture. One shot. <laughs> that guiding light does not seem sweet. Another pilgrim. But I'm not a... Get ready to be zapped. Pew, pew. Well, okay. What if I don't want a basket of stupid guiding light? I don't want that. Oh, dude, I could totally dig my way up there if I had... Nope. I probably won't be able to dig my way up there. Oh, damn. Winning! I win! probably gonna shoot at me while I'm up here. Hurry up! No, 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 why you do this? God damn it. I think it actually just screwed me over, didn't it? Yeah, it did. Can't I like reach? No, no, I can reach across. Sweet. I mean, is it only for that though? Was it only for the heart? I guess it was only for the heart. It's not really worth it. Wow, look at all these hearts out here. You're expecting people to, like, just die? Oh, there's a mechanic to how you can actually go through the door. That makes a lot more sense now. Aha! I win. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, now it fires three. Okay, that makes more sense. So this is actually like a boss fight right here. But you're still a sucker chump. You a sucker chump. Wow, it actually... Whoa, 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 whoa. That... No, 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 no. Listen, listen. Let's talk about this. This is... I, I didn't sign up for this. Is all I'm saying. Oh, damn. Okay, okay, okay. Shoot, come on, come on, come on. One more pass. Ah, oh, you scumbag. Well, in that case, I'll just stay here. Oh, you can actually hit me here as well. Whoa! Come on, 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 come on. There we go. I win. I make the rules. Hey, it was just about to light you up, crazy cultist. I tried to tell you, I'm not a cultist. Really, you bots all look the same to me. You look like some sort of Vectron sprite. How's that possible, Vectron? That's some kind of callback to something? My friend Rusty destroyed Vectron before he went missing. This cult stole me and plugged me in here to be worshipped. They wanted me to zap him. 
can't do that without my cool totem, though, so what are we gonna do now? Oh, I'm going up to the big city. I heard Rusty had been seen there. <laughs> to the city, you say? All right, if you insist, I suppose I can come with you. I didn't actually. Get out of my furnace! What, and float around here all bored and alone? Your furnace is warm and comfy and pestering you is fun. I have time for this. You need... I need to get out of here. I was like, you need my help after all. I already scanned this area and I guess I can let you use my map. Oh, my camera's on top of the map. have to move that. Uh... Also, I didn't have alerts turned on for some reason. Anyway, they're turned on now. Oh, snap. Ugh. Oh, this is the exit? <clears throat> well, I don't want to go to the exit yet, then. Oh, you actually take fall damage. Wouldn't expect you to take fall damage in this game for some reason. I was like, well, I'm sure I should be able to fall down anywhere. Guess not. Oh, is this the end of the level? Really? You're not gonna, like... Give me bonus points for exploring? It was bad, man. Why would you do this? So this is what the surface looks like. It's bright. The map is great. Can you use it to locate someone? Not even if I care. Remind me of those nasty Fen lights from my father's stories of the old country. I'll just call you Fen for short. I'm Dorothy, but my friends call me Dot. Whatever, I'm going back in your furnace now. Wake me up if something interesting happens. You know, it's, it's not very respectful. Just going to a woman's furnace like that. I mean, I guess she's a robot, but still. You know, you need to ask. This goes back in the furnace. Doesn't even ask. Vibrating with opportunities and adventure. Vote Yonka. I like his name already. Yoink. Oh, dude, can I break through here? Oh, there's probably going to be an upgrade or something that will allow me to break through that. And, of course, I can't break through there either. Come here. with the cacti. Well, this is as high as we can get. Of course, we're supposed to go this way. And, of course, I'm going to take damage from that because I'm an idiot. Hey, dudes. That isn't Dorothy McCrank. Trader Carson, didn't think I'd meet anyone I knew this far from home. Hey, what's been going on in that little tumbleton of yours? I've heard all sorts of rumors. Let me tell you. It all started when Rusty arrived, digging riches out of the mine and helping our town to prosper. Then he found some strange technology down there. If so this is how they're basically telling you the story from the first one, which, again, I never played, which is why I'm interested in actually learning more about it. <sighs> Shadow Thread, this is right at the beginning of the game. But then he found some strange technology down there, he fused with it, and it made him stronger. Come on, get the good stuff already. Well, the source of that mysterious power turned out to be dangerous to us all. He fought it and saved us, but after the fight, he disappeared. I've been trying to find him ever since. Travelers saw the posters I put up and told me Rusty had been seen entering the mine in El Machino. It's quite a story. Now, the lift up the to town is broken, so you'll have to climb the cliff to get up there. I'll be up there shortly myself. Come by if you want to buy some upgrade cogs to better handle that there mine. That there mine! You might want to come and get some cogs to handle that there mine. Just rest my joints here for a bit before I climb up the to town. Didn't we just... we just went over this. 
Probably not. I'm trying to like... I'm trying to get to the other character. Ah, there we go. The earthquake made the elevator come crashing down. Oh, did someone get crushed? Why, I never! What sort of a terrible thing are you? Not a thing. If I still had my totem, I'd zap you right now. Well, whatever you are, you need to mind your manners. Excuse me, ma'am. Fan hasn't really learned people skills yet. Oh, I was hoping I'd get something out of that. Of course. I'm always trying to get that loot. Trying to get that loot. Interesting that someone like me who likes loot so much doesn't actually like loot boxes. <laughs> God damn this industry. This industry, man. Well, it's a good thing at least doesn't seem like SteamWorld 2 has loot boxes. So there's that. Oh, wow. What a view. Why don't you take on a closer look? What a scumbag. You'll have to come closer. Closer. Hey, 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 hey. So funny. You're so funny. If I fall and die, which furnace are you going to go to, Fen? You think you're so funny? Huh? Think this is a joke? Probably does. Bastard. Can't trust him. Broken. Music is actually pretty good from the music that we've heard so far in game. Population 105. Mayor Mick Yonker. Hey there, keep calm, people. Well, actually, these earthquakes are something to worry about. I've already told you my seismometer is getting some really strange readings. There are more important things to worry about, such as keeping the ore flowing. You idiot, why don't you listen to the experts? My please, these experts with their facts are missing the big picture. What about that red scarf miner that never made it back up? I've already hired a guard to prevent more unprepared bots from disappearing. Now let's all keep our heads cool and just remind ourselves that the mayor's office is not to blame here. The mayor's office is absolutely to blame. As a matter of fact, it's all your damn fault, Mick Yonker. It's all your fault, idiot. Red Scarf Meyer, that must be ru rusty. Finally, promising lead. I think these earthquakes sound promising. Nothing like a bit of chaos liven up an adventure. I need to talk to the mayor about entering that mine. Ah, oh, this is like a friggin' friggin' crab looking creature. But it's a robot. Mayor Yonker may be a chump, but he's right this time. We need to keep that ore flowing. Barnacle Jones. <laughs> Heard he's fretting so much about it, his hair is starting to rust, see? Now me, I always take any ore off a of miner's clamps, whatever the circumstances. This one's the mayor's mother? That worthless son of mine has no idea what he's doing. We need competent people down below looking at what's causing these dang earthquakes. I know what a tectonic plate feels like when it's moving by thunder. This ain't it, dearie. How do I go back down? Oh, there's no... There's no actual thing for like, going back down with jumping? I figured that would be a thing. Doesn't seem like that's a thing. That's a shame. <coughs> How about you, lady? <clears throat> oh my, oh my, that was a pretty big earthquake. Okay, I'm getting tired of just like... All this chat. Let's go talk with the mayor. Unless there's a shopkeeper. You're not a shopkeeper. How about you? You're a shopkeeper? Everybody's scared. Hey, now I'm late for my polish. If you got complaints, leave them at my office. Dude doesn't even give a damn. If it's about the quakes, don't bother some shaking. It's just normal in these parts. I'm not here to complain. I just need access to the mine to search for a lost bot. What I need is to get the mine running again. You don't even have a proper light. You're likely to get lost yourself, and I can't afford that. Not this close to an election. Tell you what, there's a safer area to dig in, just to the left of the ladder down in the middle. You can dig up ore to buy yourself a new light. The guard will let you enter the real mine. 
I'm assuming that is part of the background and I can't actually get there. Uh, where is... Aha! This is what I need. I need a rock bottom lamp. So this is the city mine. You said there was another area to dig. This thing? Windy Plains. Ow. I wanna bash that thing. Oh shoot. Ooh, trick bastard. Oh, but they drop health. Sweet. I don't want that. That looks like ore. Cinnabar. Okay, I gotta be careful with the amount of damage I'm sustaining here, because right now, what we're doing is not sustainable. Ow. Aha! I win. Looks like we've done enough. We just have to go sell the stuff now. But, you guys know me while I'm here. Might as well make as much as we possibly can. Ooh. Ha! You thought you were going to get me. Secret area. That's right. This is some Sokoban shit. And I just failed. <laughs> I love how I instantly said, oh, this is just like Sokoban. Let me instantly fail at it. Just like I would fail Sokoban. So basically, I'll have to run through it. I'm really digging the soundtrack. No! Idiot. I fucked it up. You can get ore and you can probably get to that big rock, which is probably important. I would imagine. Which means we'll have to go through and do this again. It's basically like puzzle, uh, puzzle section. Which I guess that, that might be why they're not using... Um, why they're not using procedural generation on this one. Because you probably can't do as good puzzles with procedural generation. Whereas this way you can actually get some- Oh shoot! You can actually get some sweet puzzles going. Great cog. I was hoping I'd be able to break this. Oh shoot, I almost forgot there's also this here. Give me the minerals! Azurite, 20 bones! That's right, baby! Hitting that bank today! <laughs> okay. I'm just supposed to go and sell the resources, but I'm not quite ready to do that yet. Oh, these things respawn, huh? Get good, kid. So if you don't actually die, if you don't actually take damage, I mean, you can actually 
get more stuff. Okay, so I'm going to need a special pickaxe, some kind of upgrade pickaxe to break those rocks. like a checkpoint right here. I have no idea where I'm going. I'm gonna get myself killed is what I'm gonna do. in there. some goddamn upgrades that's right baby it is however a bit of a problem because now I have to make it back and I don't think I'm allowed to die I kind of get the idea that if you die in this game you probably will lose all of the loot because that would kind of make sense the whole risk reward thing although I'm not really looking to find out if that is going to be the case or not Because that would set us back quite a bit. Oh no. Dude. <laughs> I got scared there for a while. I better not screw this up. Oh, look at that. Another secret area. What's this? Your bag's already full, doofus. Oh. Well, that friggin' sucks. Is that thing gonna be there when I come back? Damn. Well, that's gonna that's gonna have to be like the first upgrade we do. It's like need more bag space. Needs more bag space. No. Uh uh uh. uh. Get, get back. Get back. Atta boy. Take that and that and that. Oh, do I have to go through this thing? Miss me, sucker chump, sucker chump. Oops. Why am I not being able to grab onto this ladder? There we go. We're going to really check out the DLC for Destiny 2. I don't know. Most likely not, because that's when Xenoblade Chronicles embargo lifts. It's in December, and I think I'm just going to spend most of December playing Xenoblade Chronicles. Hello! I see you've broken your light source. Might want to fix your light first. Okay. I want upgrades. Give me the rock bottom lamp. Wait, I'll need to sell shit first. Who do I oh, I sell to this guy? Oh, this guy just buys random shit. Okay. 
pounds is in fact you found a fresh bot to work in the mine. <laughs> Looks like a real McCoy, but boy, was he a flat tire. Didn't come back even once, see? Hope you'll do a better job, kid. Now that's what I'm talking about. Iron pickaxe. True wide pack. Upgrade the backpack. Get one extra slot for ores and gems. And the miner's bright. More economic when it comes to burn time. Upgrade the lamp. Reduce fuel consumption. Dude, but I want the backpack. Hells yeah. Reaper's discount. This tool can't be upgraded. Sprint hydraulics can't be upgraded. Is that it? Okay. Very well, now let's check out the cog mods. Map markers. Those markers in your map on your quest destinations. If you prefer exploration without guidance, disable this cog mod. Okay. Can't do this, but I can get this. Makes you lose less resources when you die. Probably important, but isn't there something better like meat tier two pickaxe? Yeah, see, this is much more important. The pickaxe stuff. So I want to go get more money, and I already know where to get it before we actually go to the mine. That's the best part. Oh, and there's a fuel gauge on my lamp now, so that's how long the lamp's gonna burn for. Okay, we'll definitely want to upgrade that lamp as soon as possible, too. But I'm assuming once the lamp dies, it's gonna become significantly harder to keep on digging. I like the... the simulation-type elements on this. It's not simulation, obviously. What I'm saying is, like, the whole thing where the lantern burns out. It's an interesting mechanic to kind of have you go back to town. Is what I'm saying. Oh, snap! Winning! That's what's up. It's dropping them fat sacks. Oh, shoot! Damn, that hurt. So, we've already been to this secret area. Dude, I lost like one and a half hearts out of that. Oh, but something's dead over here. I'll take that. Oh, it's the loot that we've left behind. It actually stays there. That's good to know. Oh, and you also get fuel out of the thing. Okay. Huh, we've already filled up on ore. Isn't this the secret area that we found last time? L's to the yeah. I don't know how much of that is worth. Hopefully a whole bunch so that we can do some more upgrades. But other than this, I don't actually think there were that many more things for us to get. Take that and that and that. We're actually pretty close to leveling up. How's that gonna work out? That's not gonna work out. It's not gonna work out at all. Ah, but we leveled up! <laughs> yeah! Oh, well, we got 15, coal, uh, 15 gold. We got three upgrade cogs, but we're going to be selling some more ore, which means more of that sweet moolah. More of that moolah. Did I mention the soundtrack's really good? Soundtrack and visuals are like super solid for this title. My opinion's just really well done. Got anything shiny for me? Well, hells yeah, I do. 28, baby. Time to get that... Time to get that sweet new pickaxe. I want me a new pickaxe, baby. Yeah, give me that mod. Plus five extra experience from enemies defeated with a pickaxe, motherfucker. That's right. That is absolutely correct, sir. We can now get more... Oh, we can actually upgrade the pickaxe even more. 
Dude, this is almost like this is a kind of loot, um, a kind of gameplay loop that I usually tend to find very satisfying in video games, which is like, go down, like, go do an activity, get upgrades, and then come back, and then keep upgrading yourself so that you can do the activity for longer or with more... In a way, it's almost like Monster Hunter. And I know that's kind of like a dumb comparison you guys are going to say, but it's like, think of it like this. You hunt monsters. You get better weapons. You get better armor. You hunt bigger monsters. This is kind of the same thing. You dig. You get better tools. You dig deeper. Until, like the dwarves of old, you dig too deep. <laughs> you have dug too deep. What do you want? Looks like you're all about ready to dig. So you let me go deeper into mine now? Sure. Show me you can light the lantern over there and I'll open the hatches. About time someone started mining in these tunnels again. On the right track to find Rusty. I reckon your compadre went to pass through Red Rock Passage one time or another. Not only could just get the pneumatic tube system to get you there and back. Fogged up during an earthquake, though it'd be smart to clear it out first. Thought I'd just open these hatches and let it down there. Yeah. Let us down there. Last thing, miss. You're about to explore a large and hazardous world down there. If you like to keep track of where you're heading, you can use these markers on your map. Yeah. I reckon that's a sign of wise bot. If you want, you can always toggle the markers. Yep, I know. Now I won't keep you any longer. Good luck, Colonel the Tubes. Not before I go in there, though. I mean, look at all this stuff out here. Ow. Look at all the loot we can get out here before we even get started. Trashium? Oh shoot, that doesn't sound like a good idea. Son of a gun. How dare you. How damn dare you. Give me more Trashium. It's like the best element. Trashium. I <laughs> gotcha. More trashium. Everybody likes trashium, right? So there's no actual benefit in breaking all of these then. I mean, sometimes I guess they'll... Oh, you'll eventually be able to break that one. Jesus, what's with the light? Why is the light already gone? Dude, you get like no time on this flashlight. Look at how fast it's going down. Oh, you got to keep killing the stuff in order to get more, huh? I wonder if I kill that thing. Me light, talk to Fern. Go up and replenish your lamp so we don't get lost down here. Oh, dude, that is a really short timing on this lantern, though. Yeah, I gotta get, I gotta get that lantern upgrade. Gotta get that lantern upgrade like yesterday, son. Need them lamp upgrades. Okay, whatever. I don't care. Yeah, I'll I'll get the tubes open, whatever. I want the level two lamp, dude. Do we get cogs for the lantern? Yes, we do. Um, sure. Yeah, this is a problem, how how little the light lasted. You know, that was like a serious issue. Trashium. Scumbag monster.
here's something I'm curious about. That didn't do as big. That didn't do what I thought it was going to. I need the pickaxe to deal more damage so that I can kill that thing in two swings. It's gonna make quite a bit of difference. There's actually quite a few mechanics that remind me of Dig Dug. I'm not sure if the original SteamWorld Dig also had those kinds of mechanics. Like the way that the stuff falls. Oh, damn it, I just messed it up. Come on. Luckily, I still get health out of it, so... Not the end of the world. Dude, even with the upgrades, it's still... So limited. I'll probably want to go from above. if you were able to refuel your lantern at these points. I'm assuming you'll eventually get some kind of upgrade that will let you do that, eventually. Oh, we did get light off of them, so it's like, it's also a bit of a speed challenge to like just go through as fast as you can so that you can get stuff. So if you actually go faster and not be as careful as I'm being, you can potentially keep exploring more, but it's just like, it makes me not be as efficient as I would like to be, you know? These guys know me. I'm all about friggin', when it comes to a game like this, I'm all about that strip mining action. What? I'm full? Ugh. Gotta upgrade these bags, man. That ain't right. I don't care. I'm full. I ain't got nothing to lose. Uh, what am I gonna do here? Let's get that thing. And oh, actually, I can't. I can't really do much. Oh snap! That actually fell way deeper than I was hoping. Hey, we're still able to get another blood droplet. And this is with an upgraded bag. Okay, so I kind of feel that they should allow you to stay here for a bit longer. It's like having to go back to town already. We've barely been in the mine. We've had to go back to town twice. And I feel like the, the loop should take me longer. It'll allow me to stay playing. <laughs> should allow me to keep playing for a while longer. That's what I'm getting at. I mean, I probably can't even upgrade anything right now, so... Sturdy armor. Bag of holding. Tier 3 backpack. Well, we definitely want that. Cash on disposal. What the hell is that? Discarding a resource grants you a share of its monetized value. Actually, I don't... Oh, you can uninstall it? Oh, my God. So you can just... You never really lose your... Dude. Just, like, not even kidding. So many developers don't understand this. Which is why our brains at this point... Like, I'm not even kidding. This is a major... Just, just this little feature right here is a major thing in games that a lot of developers need to learn. Which is... Don't force us to commit to something unless there's a specific reason for you forcing us to commit to that thing. Because, like, a lot of times, a lot of games don't actually allow people to experiment 
because of their prohibitive upgrade systems. Like, well, once you put that point in there, you're fucking married to it. You put a ring on there and that's that. So just like this thing alone, massive props, massive props. The fact that you're gonna install and install these things, it will. Psh. Might seem like a really simple thing, but it is super important. At least in my opinion. Like, I could be wrong. Maybe some people are like, no, you. Back in my day, you had to commit your points in Diablo 2. And it's like, yes. And it was fucking stupid. <laughs> <laughs> like, there's a lot of good things about older games, there's also a lot of shit. Like, you know how people are super excited about, for instance, World of Warcraft classic servers? I think they're gonna get there and they're gonna be like, well, actually, vanilla wasn't as fun as I remembered. Maybe I don't want to play vanilla WoW after all. <laughs> wow, these things explode. Things go boom. That was cool. Can I break this? No, because my pick's not powerful enough. Well, I can break that. <laughs> Ow. Why you gotta be doing that to me, man? You're just like breaking my balls here. Oh, snap. I have to find another way to get through there. Nobody likes you. I wish I could like just take this thing with me, but I can't. Oh, door's locked. What? Oh, what? That wasn't very fair. I wasn't expecting him to do that. Ah, you can break it from this side. Burster Station. Give my health points. Dude, I don't know if I can reach there, but I'm definitely gonna try. Yeah! But I can't go any further up, and I've lost half of my health. This is great. I'm gonna die. Oh! <laughs> that was almost death number one right there. Dodge that bullet. You're not gonna charge at me, are you? Good boy. Oh crap. Press the wrong button. Ooh. Give me the powers. New powers. Power up. Pressure bomb. See, now you're talking. Oh. That's how that works. Okay. Alrighty. They're probably going to be playing around with this thing, not allowing you to use it when when you actually really need it. Oh, it looks like now they're also going to give me water. I can't fire the pressure gun while I'm jumping. Aha, uh -huh, I see what you did there. What? Oh, come on. Come on, don't tease me like this. That's not right. Dude. 
How are you gonna tease me like that, bro? Oh, okay, I get it. I can do it off of here. I was like, what the hell, man? Oh, my face! In the face! In the face! My face! Why you do this? I should probably go get some um, more water just in case I need it. Always want to try to keep your resources available to you as much as possible. And we're running out of light, which is a serious problem. Serious friggin' problem. You, give me light. Light. Wow. You're gonna die now. How does that make you feel? And I still win. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna die, and I win. This Ractus Novicus added to your collection. Sounds like some dirty rat. I found myself a dirty rat team. We found ourselves a dirty rat. Dirty rat. You dirty rat. He probably killed our brother too. That's what he did. Killed our brother. Dirty rat. You killed my brother. You dirty rat. Overall, we've already done this, so pretty much we've done most of what I can find in this level. I can't find anything else, so let's just get some water and get the hell out of dodge. Get the hell out of dodge! I'm not gonna be able to make that jump. We have to go this way. Yeah. No, wait, I have to go the other way around. <laughs> you saw them trying to trick me? They were trying to trick me, but I saw it. I saw it through their trickery. I see through your trickery, sir. And I will have none of it. None of the trickery, thank you very much. We are running low on light. Which means I'm gonna kill this beastie. Come back, give me light! Well, it is dark as all hell now. Well, this isn't particularly useful. I wonder if I stay here long enough, they will send something after me, kind of like Spelunky. Kind of feels like that's the next logical step to not having light. We didn't get as many resources as I would like. What, what's up with this guy? You found one fascinating artifact already. A dirty rat. Show my appreciation. I'll also hand you a blueprint from my stack. And we have to take it over to the workbench and use the Cogmoss to put it to good use. Gaze of Odin. Okay. Well, we don't have that much money because we first need to sell. But we're not going to make that much money because I didn't get that many things. So we're not going to be able to get upgrades, but we can use the Cogs. We have another cog there. We got what's this? Molotov vaccination stops pressure bombs from hurting you. I don't really care. Displays your enemy's health once you've damaged them. Eh, don't care about that. Reminds me a little bit of that, that particular upgrade. Reminds me of Nier Automata. Nier Automata. How you can turn off certain UI elements for your benefit. Uh, there's nothing really that I want. I just want to like reload my can. Can I go into the bathroom? No. It's 
too much. Bathroom's too much. I get it. Did I get everything that I could out of this? I probably did. All of that trashium. I'm assuming essentially what I have to find now is like a shortcut. No! Barrel. Score. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Although I definitely meant to do it this time. We can't grab on iron walls. Somehow it doesn't feel particularly fair, but okay. Pretty sure I'd be able to... If I, well, no, actually it does. It is correct. It's like, I guess iron could be slippy, slippery, whereas rock is not slippery. I mean secret area uncovered, are you kidding me? It's like the only way to get out of the map. How could you have not uncovered that secret area? That seems like impossible. Well, we found another artifact. We need three more until we get the next unlock, so. Oh, dude, that trashium's so good. Dig right through them suckers. Hmm, I can use a bomb to get this. Actually, no, I should have used it there, but... Dude, I just used a bomb for trashium. Dig right through that ass. Well, that's what you get. Proof tell bonus. Bonus 15%. Now we're talking. What's this? Red Rock Passage. I'm not sure if that's where, I, where I'm supposed to go, but... I do what I want. That's cool. Must be Red Rock Passage. It's all caved in. You could use the bombs to clear it up. Maybe it'll even blow some of your parts off. Aha! So now I can just drop right into the pipe. And we got water here. Oh, come on. Boom, let's do that again. If only I could be so grossly incandescent. Love your streams and look forward to more. Do boom a foo, becoming grossly incandescent for four months in a row. Thank you very much for the support. Tip of the hat to you, sir. Really, really appreciate it. Rurikon, did you see the MP first article on EA firing the PVZ creator? Nope. Not a huge fan of PVZ, so I don't care. Guess I should tell the mayor that the passage is open again. Uh, oh, 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 oh. I can smell it on you. They keep trying to trick me. They keep trying to trick me, but they, they don't succeed. You'll never succeed in tricking me. Okay, time to head back to El Camino. Warhard 94, what does water do for you? It fills up your bomb gun. Ah, 
That's what the bonus was for, is because when you level up, you get more bonuses. And look for Rusty Deeper Down. That boss still missing? Well, just don't forget to bring up some of that valuable ore up with you now. Should be clear mining all the way down to the protective wall, dearie. Guess your pal could have slipped through one of the darn cracks in it. If I was you, I'd head down to Mason Station. See an old equipment machine down there will make your life a whole lot easier. And one of my idiot brothers walled in last year while laying brick. Bet you can find a way around a brick if you scout the place. All the way down there? That's crazy talk. So how do I... Ah, so now I can just like teleport... Wait. How do I teleport to the pipes? That's the important bit. Oh, the... There's probably pipes that you... Ooh, carbide lamp. Flame of Kubera. The hell's Flame of Kubera? Causes pickups to emit light, which in turn makes them easier to discover. New tier 3 lamp. How about... No, we're gonna we're gonna save for the pickaxe. We're gonna save for the next pickaxe. Although we could use the cogs for something. I mean even if we're not using it for anything, might as well put it on something. Like sure, give me the health. There's nothing else that I really wanna do that much and give me whatever this is. Although we haven't even died once! Not even once! Oh, there's the pipes. I was like, where's the pipe? It's right here. I don't I don't care. If only I could be so grossly incandescent. Switzerland finally has KFC. Haven B with seven months of grossly incandescence. Thank you very much for your support. Tip of the hat to you, sir. Really appreciate it. You see the new hat, Paven B? Look at that shit. Got the feather. So, I want to go back up, though, even though we've come all the way down. I want to go back up, because... still stuff to find further up. Uh, I wish I could, like... We're gonna have to go through here. The music is so good. Nobody can argue with me on that music. That rock's gonna do some gnarly damage. Actually, I might as well have come from the other way around if I was going to pull this stun. It's just I want to investigate stuff on this side before I fully commit to the other side. But we've been here, right? What is this, Mason? No, this is Burster Station. Makes sense that it's called Burster, considering the weapon that we got out here. Wasn't there something that is in here that I still haven't been able to get? Yeah, this thing. I need to figure out how to open this. Oh, shoot, I missed this. They tricked me! They actually tricked me that one time. Don't look at me. Don't even look at me, you goddamn cockroach. They actually tricked me that one time. It was only one time, though, and we came back. I knew there was something that I was missing there. Problem is now we're also missing light. I might as well go back upstairs to get more light. Because I mean, I don't want to like start an exploration delve without having light. And we'll sell this little dropling thing that we got here, a little blood dropling. Who oh, no. knew? It's so dark. We don't have any light. It's all over, Rakan. Get the light. Someone get the lights, please. Please. We want the light. The lights, please. Lights, please. Hey, bro. I fixed everything. <laughs> I'm 
Okay. Anyway, now that we've gotten that, just sell this. Dude, dude, like, dude, stop talking my ear out. He's like literally talking my ears off. Come on. Oh, don't wake up. You have to act quick when they're about to wake up. There's got to be some secret up there. I can I can smell it. I can smell it. My spidey sense is tingling. Trashium, dude? I don't want trashium. You need to stop it with the trashium nonsense. It's getting old. It was funny for a while. That one's gonna wake up. That means I'm gonna have to kill both of them. Both of yous! You fucking cockroach. Yeah, we got him good. Dude, you just really always want to uh, break stuff on top. Always. Don't wake up, no! Got it. in a bar so we can just crush him with this rock right here yeah you loved it I do want to fall. But my loot! That rock just took away with my loot. Completely unacceptable. No, my loot! Dude, that thing destroys loot. Friggin' rocks. They just destroy my loot. They need to stop that nonsense. That's a bunch of gold that went down with that loot. <laughs> oh, what was that? No, stop. I was like, yeah, yeah, I'm going to break your platform. And then it dicked me over. Cave in Catacomb. This is gonna be bad. This is gonna be very bad. Better run. Oh shoot, I thought there was actually loot down there, but I guess not. That kind of sucks. Dude, there's like a passage up there. I can smell it. But I don't know how to get it. Makes me sad whenever I see treasure that I cannot find. I want all of the treasure, not just some of the treasure. Oh, dude, there's like giant boulders everywhere. I have to make another run for it. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Ah, look at the little tricksters. I see what you're doing there. You can't fool me. Spelunky Diary, add it to your collection. Give me another upgrade, Cog. You know what I want. 
He knows what I want. Oh, there is no secret passage in there, actually. That was it. It was just a couple of upgrade cogs and uh, things. I, I guess I expected more from some of these things, but... Ah, Already full on this particular type of ore. How far away are we from the two? Hopefully not too far. Dude, we are getting pretty far from the tubes. Wait a second, there's actually places to go to in here that I haven't been. Valuables to trade with me. Am I gonna get enough for my new pickaxe? Yes! Give me the new pickaxe. Yeah, buddy. What is this? Deals extra damage to resource tiles. It's my way or the tile way. Okay. I'll take that. It's my way or the tile way. Okay, so what do you got? You got new things? Crisscross combination. Oh, this seems very important. Seems important, crisscross combination. Probably important. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Show me, show me, show me, show me, show me. Show me, show me, show me. Show me. Breaking resource tiles creates small burst that damages adjacent tiles. Hells yeah. Fate engine. Mysterious upgrades that shift the gears powering the universe. The symptom of the universe is written in your eyes. That's cool stuff. Wait, what am I doing here? We're not going this way. We're gonna go to the pipes. Them pipes. Them pipes. Crap, I gotta keep it together there. Um, I thought that me damaging tiles was going to cause them to damage other tiles. Am I wrong there? Because that's what you told me. Oh, only resource tiles though. Never mind. I can make this big rock fall down. And usually when I can do something, I feel it is my responsibility to do it. got two beefy gems, which means I'm not going to be able to make that much more money out of this. Kind of sucks. Then again, this is where we were last time, so we pretty much made it back to where we were. And I've also spent most of the life that I had available to me. No! The resources, though. God damn it.
No! We actually didn't lose that much, though. But yeah, we got wrecked. We got wrecked pretty hard. Still lost some stuff. to where I was, where we died. I've come here, right? Yeah, Cave and Catacomb, we've done this. This is the big mess up that we did. Oh, there's materials there. There be materials there. up and start digging back down. Damn it, these fucking rocks. I used to think they were fun. I used to think these rocks were fun. You know what I'm saying? That mindset has changed. They're not that fun. Goddamn rocks. Cell bonus, 20%. Making that moolah. Making that, making that mo mo moolah. thought you were gonna get me this time yes you did just as I was making fun of it I was like yeah 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 no no I escaped you still made a decent profit that's the works an RKO. <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> I love you guys. You guys are fucking awesome. <laughs> it's just like, I was saying, ah, you thought you were going to give me that. Everybody in chat is just going to like, yes, they did. The fake out. <laughs> pretty chill game oh wait no not this way stop everything not imagine it runs 
pretty. Then again, it's not like a very demanding game at the end of the day. Trojan Sack, Tier 4 Backpack. Probably want that. Hmm. The Trojan Sack, Dual Depot. Let's you store two gems per slot. Guarding a resource. Well, I haven't really been using that one. Uh, what else? Increase the lamp light radius. We want that. Five extra XP. What is this one? Makes you lose less resources when you die. We've been dying quite a lot, so I probably shouldn't get rid of this one. Um, I'd get rid of this for now so that I can get that. And then I'll get that back again later. Is my opinion that's more important. I want to get the lamp next, though. Many knows. Dude, yo, no! Shh, God damn it. He had to hit me. He just had to do it, didn't he? He just friggin' had to do it. Prick bastard. Nobody likes you. Evil monster of doom. Did I make it all the way down here? Doesn't matter, we must dig deeper. Hey, there's a prison over there. I want that prison. I want to give you some. Here. Have this. I like them apples, huh? Oh, that's right, without on the cacti thing. Bro dingers, what? Oh, windy plains. I remember this. Wow. We are far away. I've been risking it way too much with the amount of health that I've had available to me. Way too much. It is a damn shame. Because now we're dead. Now it's all over. But anyway, I got a pretty good idea what this game's about. I like it. I like it a lot, but I want to check out some other stuff today. So I'm going to take a very quick break. So you guys don't go anywhere. We'll be back really shortly. Um, and yeah. I like the game. Solid, another solid, I was about to say Twitch. Another solid Switch title. Switch is like one of the best consoles in recent years. I'm super surprised with it. 
Anyway, guys, I'll be back in a bit. Uh, so just uh, don't touch that dial.